Stay still. Stay still. Come on. Stay Come on. Still. Right, hold on. No, no, no. no. Oh. Oh. Let's try that again, but with ninja stars. <gasps> Hey, why did we pick a fruit shaped exactly like my head? Just stop talking, you're ruining my concentration. You're fine, chill. He's gonna die. Yeah. Ah. Ah. Wait, did you hear that? What was that? Well, not that we can do. You guys wanna grab pizza? Can I kick it? 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 What the heck are those things? Those look like little Shreks to me. Can I kick it? Oh, we've prepared our whole lives for this. Can I kick it? Oh my god! Oh my, I'm gonna be sick. Leo, what happened? Is Donnie it's bleeding? It was an accident. Mikey, watch out! So, you were baby turtles who made contact with mystery goo. Well, we prefer the term ooze, but yeah. It's like more like, it's just nicer. It, it, it rolls off the tongue better, yeah. Ooze. 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 It's nice, right? Ooze. It's ooze. your help. We're detecting increased aquatic activity 25,000 feet deep in the trench. It's an ancient ecosystem untouched by man. Whatever is down there is trying to make its way to the surface. This was a bad idea. Just a little bit. Jonas, we've got company. That's the biggest Meg I've ever seen. Biggest Meg anyone's ever seen. That's the apex predator. Everybody back into the station! You can make it! Hit fly! Three massive Megs and who knows what else have escaped the breach. I just hope it goes better than last time. What happened last time? You don't want to know. They say the end, you go, go, go! We've never seen this before. They hunted it back. You can relax. This place, magproof. I mean, Jonas was always afraid of this, but I was also thinking. Yes.
Hello, Orson. We try to think about the floor. Of course, naturally. I had gotten used to being one of the leaders in my last job. I was determined to build up the same position at work. That's how the coffee machine works. This is how the blinds work. Whenever anyone looked at me, I fired off a broad smile. A smile disarms your opponent and makes them doubt their own enmity. I stuck to my schedule when I first discovered the room. There was something special about this place. Answer me truthfully. What is this room for? Don't drag me into this. I found a secret room, and when I work in there, I'm able to do anything. A secret room? It's just that most people aren't able to see it. Were you on drugs? What are you doing? What are you doing when you stand like that? What are you talking about? Do you have any idea what that's about? It's very strange. I say, fire him. If he's allowed to stand there like that, then I should be allowed to practice Reiki in the break area. There is no room, Orson. Didn't I tell you it was pointless to try and conduct psychological warfare against me? You have secrets hidden in there that for whatever reason you don't want me to see. But he's mental. Anyone can see that. I did try to warn you. I must insist that you stop going to it. You're different from the other people here. I can tell. Orson? You want to tell me how far in advance all of this got worked out? Was I even one of the original intended victims? What exactly is it that you want? I just want to do my job. I don't care about you. You're a number in a column on a spreadsheet. I could view the world as something ominous, looming. Or I could choose to see the light. I chose to see the light. Say hello to the newest member of the collective. May the privilege fall. That's code. Don't forget it. The CIA have a list of enemies they consider untouchable. Take a look at that file. Miro Lundell. Notorious human trafficking kingpin. Basically untouchable. So is he. Ow. Can I come in? I'm uh, new. I don't know you. What do you want to know? Work for the DA. You watch enough guilty people walk free, and eventually you want to go out there and take care of them yourself. The collective are getting close to finding us. I want that collective dead. Dead. Found him. I'll send some guys. We speak for the innocent. Judge, jury, and executioner. Let's make him fall. We have a problem. That's well done. We're in a league of our own. You blew up my house, Sam. It happens. Hi, buddy. Love you, Dad. Hey, Nitz. Where's the band? They bailed. Sorry. Seriously? I'm trying to run a business here. Also, the bank called. Hey, brother. Joe? I got something to tell you. Dad got a call yesterday from a guy at a record company. He says he heard our record and, uh... Our record? What do you mean? Dreaming Wild. Great to meet you. I wanted to talk to you about this. There it is, it's Raymond Wild. That's you guys? Yeah, that's us. This album is unbelievable, truly. It really just blew my mind. How did you do it? 
Donnie made it all right here. Donnie, what you got going on over there? I was playing around. Donnie's a genius, truthfully. And then what happened? We're gonna need some more money to get these last few songs finished. My dad lost a lot. We find albums that never found an audience. We try to give them a second chance. And based on all the buzz the record has got, you've seen that, right? During its finest moments, to twist a Brian Wilson phrase, dreaming wild is a godlike symphony to teenhood. Brian Wilson. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, heck, let's celebrate. <laughs> you got a gift. You gotta use it. I believe in you, boys. New York Times wanted to do a story on you guys. Are you kidding me? And now he wants it to be the kickoff for a tour. It's so weird to have this now. I'm not sure what to do with all of it. I have spent my whole life trying to make music. It's just fun for you. It's not just fun for me. Feel so good walking side by side. Be we made that album. We were so happy. <laughs> just didn't know anything about the world. Things were a lot easier when I was a teenager. I'm just sorry, Dad, for putting you through all of it. You're my son. I would have gladly given up all the land just to hear you play. The Demeter. On charter from Romania to London. Shipping private crates. Contents unknown. Out at sea with no land in sight. This here is Clemens. He's a doctor. You dress like a learned man. University of Cambridge. I know my way around the boat. Our charter has agreed to pay a bonus for timely arrival in London. Let me show you the ship. This here is Huckleberry. We don't come with like this to give the yours clear. To me, it's a fine boat, no doubt. This looks like a bite. Search the ship. Everywhere. Evil is on board. Powerful evil. the original cast of Studio C. Why does he have band-aids on his nipples? Yeah, he's a runner. Who knows why any of those sickos do what they do? Well, that's what I would do. I'm suffocating. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? I want my half cent, you thieving enchantress. Ooh, I'm stuck. I'm quite stuck. Who's the luckiest girl in the world? It's me. I believe oxen are much more depressed than I realize. Well, how to do? Narrated by Sean Astin. Shall we be off then? 
Westwood Ho, my comrades! Oregon Trail, here I come. I got the dysentery down in my bowels. Where? Down in my bowels today. And if that chamber pot don't like it, it can sit on attack. Ouch! Sit on attack today. I think that we ought to change our town slogan. A great place to call home is confusing. I suggest a great place to refer to as home. <clears throat> we need a crosswalk on Trent Avenue between Frost and Allegheny. And also... Oh my. A UFO has crashed in my backyard, has taken out my azaleas, and destroyed my birdbath. When you talk like that, it makes them all take us less seriously. Did you just say UFO? Oh, good Christ, what is that? You remember the spaceship? This is the little man who came out of it. He's gotta be a secret. Don't tell anybody. Can I touch him? She shouldn't know. We gotta trust her. There's nothing else we can do. We could kill her. Kill me? You can't kill me. I'll kill you. That's what I'll do. Guys, stop it. You think we can call him Jules? He's no Jules, he's more of a Gary. Your dad was in here earlier. He said he was buying apples for an alien. Like an illegal alien? Thank you for the picture. He hands them to me all the time. Maybe he's trying to tell you something. Dad, come on. I'm worried. What you have said has not been normal. I'm okay. How can you say that when you're buying apples for an alien? The government is searching for a security satellite that crashed. Any moment we waste is a moment they can discover him. You've seen the movies. You know what happens to these guys when they fall to Earth. We will break the sky wide open. Jules has come to mean quite a bit to us. It's about Dad buying apples for an alien. National security, open the door! They're coming! Us four hanging out together. We get along pretty well. We're so thankful for you. you got me. What the? Finish scraping the gum off that lounger or what? Uh, everything right now feels so out of reach. You always land on your feet, bro. You're high man. They don't get out much. <laughs> I just wanna rap. Jenny? I just wanna rap. Guard the hybrid no life, but do not open it. You went in to get a shop, and all you brought back was a hamburger? Okay, I don't think it's a burger. You haven't looked? What the hell is that? How did you get it to do that? I think he likes me. Ah! He's on your back! Get it off! Get it off! Hurry, man. This ain't what you want. 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 What the? Host acquired. Who said that? It's okay, it's gonna be okay! Oh. Oh. oh, my space. Free entry systems ready. Wait, 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 no, no! This ain't what you want. This ain't what you want. This ain't what you want. Oh. What is going on? I just wanna run. It's called the Scarab. It's some kind of world-destroying weapon. It's designed to protect its host. Sometimes it does what you want, and sometimes it doesn't. I, I think I cut a bus in half? The Scarab chose you, but it belongs to me. Hello, you feel for your family. 
makes you weak. I just wanna rock. The universe has sent you a gift, and you have to figure out what you're gonna do with it. Whatever you can imagine, I can create. Let's party. Nice choice. I just wanna rock. It's like Batman stuff. Batman's a fascist. I just wanna rap. Hi there, uh, big dogs. I'm trying to get home. I know which way that is. Oh, great. Right up my ass, you little Oh, no, that can't be right. This is Will Ferrell. I'm lost. You're a stray man. You can do anything you want. This beer doesn't taste good, but I like how it's making me feel. This is Jamie Foxx. I recently this couch. Best sex of my life. Yeah, and she dirty too. No, oh, well, I, I can tell. Looks like she hasn't been washed in years. I'll see you later, baby. It was nice to meet you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really should find my way back home. Any places, landmarks you remember? I remember the devil in the sky. Look at that guy. Burn in hell, mother son of a dumb smile. Those pants. Rip your oh. off and make Stupid you what? hat. We're completely lost, and my little puppy paw pads are really hurting right now. This could be a lot worse. How could this get worse? Ah! Hold on, buddy! Ah! Holy f That is the craziest thing I have ever seen. And I'm Dennis Quaid, and Dennis Quaid has seen some I'm starving. How many of these should we eat? Mm -hmm. All of them? Give me a sec. Whoa, you look different. You look different too. How so? Is it my human hands? Hold up. Sit! The cops! Oh god, what do we do? Calm down. I got this. Hello, officer. None of us. Shut the f up. Strays in theaters August 18. Rated R. You know, you really captured his essence. Maybe his face could use a little more detail, though. It's like a photograph. I'm Adam. Chloe. One, two, three. Sure, you're not gonna make fun of me. Just Maybe show I'll... me. <sighs> All right. Oh my God. This might be the nicest thing anyone's ever done for me. You have six. They don't have love in their culture. They find romantic stuff super exotic and interesting. They pay to watch you go on dates. Family dinner is one of our most cherished human rituals. Do you have to do this right now, Chloe? You're not supposed to talk about the broadcast on the broadcast. Would you keep that shit out of my line of sight? Why don't you keep your shit out of our line of sight? You didn't invent courtship broadcast, bitch. It has recently become obvious you are deceiving your viewers. What? Deceiving? The title of your broadcast is Adam and Chloe in love. And yet you are not in love. <laughs> I want you to repay all funds you have received. Wait. We've already spent everything we made just to live. Then I will take you to court, and your families will be in debt for approximately six generations. Do you realize... oh, no! Do you want me to cut that for you? Where is the nearest restaurant? No part of my body can make that noise. It's it... Well, it, it certainly won't if you don't try. We can get that love back. Romantic love is the most poetic of all human love modes. It should never be faked. I'm just like any other person. I want to grow up and fall in love and be swept off my feet. We've lost a lot since you guys came here. But we've overcome a lot too.
Who do you think the best driver is? Probably Rory. I would dust him in a lap. Jan, all you do is play video games with some crazy dreams of racing cars. Dad, you're the one that told us to always do something we love. You know what racing cars cost? Look around. It's not our world, son. What is this? It's a contest. The best Gran Turismo players in the world get a chance to compete in professional racing. Dude, this is real. This is real. I'm sorry. You really think you're going to take a kid who plays video games in their bedroom, you're going to strap them to a 200 mile an hour rocket. It'll tear them to pieces. You can hate me now. It's not going to work. The guys who race are elite athletes. But I won't stop now. Your kids are scrawny little gamer kids. Well, that's where you come in. Come on, let's go. Because I can't stop now. Must be a new experience for you moving your legs. <laughs> You puked on my lawn. There's no turning back now. When you're in a race, the cockpit is going to be 140 degrees Fahrenheit. The G-forces will be twice what an astronaut experiences upon liftoff. I can't see anything! Hey, you get extra points for that in the game? Jesus Christ. I had to hustle hard, never give up. This whole thing is insane, but out of the couch surfing nerds that you sent me, he is the best one. You made it. Yes! Welcome to Team Nissan. What's next? It's the major leagues. The other drivers are going to hate you. Come on! Whoopsie! Dude, what is your problem? It's part of the game, it's called racing. But I won't stop now. If you miss a line in the game, you reset. You miss it on the track, you could die. You can hate me now. Me, but I won't stop now. I know this track. Because I can't stop now. I've raced it a thousand times. That's what I'm talking about. But I won't stop now. Four, three, two, one. Today, the Egyptian and Syrian armies launched an offensive against Israel. Our enemies hope to surprise the citizens of Israel on Yom Kippur. Our troops are outnumbered seven to one. If the Arabs reach Tel Aviv, Israel will be wiped off the map. My day, they stood for the Prime Minister. Secretary Kissinger is on the line. Remember that I am first an American, second I am Secretary of State, and third I am a Jew. You forget that in Israel we read from right to left. The American people will pay a high price for supporting Israel. If we have to, we will fight alone. Our troops on the canal, they're surrounded. You rescue these boys. Might lead to catastrophe. If the Americans throw us to the dogs, I will not be taken alive. The Egyptians have fired a cruise missile at Tel Aviv. Well, I'm not going to get under the table, but don't let me stop you. Oh, if the Egyptians defeat us with Soviet weapons, what message does that send to the free world? Oh, by water. The Russians are preparing 11 airborne divisions. When I was a child in Ukraine, they would beat Jews to death in the street for fun. I am not that little girl hiding in the cellar. Hold by brave ascent, hold by accident. Do you know how many people died? All those boys. I will carry that pain to my grave. Hold by his lady's command. Hold by his... We will keep fighting for a guarantee of life and peace. Now, shall I say, is quiet?